JP, JP, can you guys guess who this JP looks like? Guys, this JP looks like um Tolani Badge, right? Yes, so Tolani Badge of uh, Lockdown Edition. Welcome back again, guys. Let's just see what's going on. So, coming from Ricky Chidi, so JP says she has about five to seven men. Yes, guys, that's what she said last night, you know, during their introduction. Okay, on her roster outside the house, and she is currently in a serious relationship with two of those men that's what she said i heard that very well and she will be flirting around with all the men in the house hermes your sister has arrived okay guys she said that because you know she, um her mother is a single mom and i think she came from a polygamous home that's something like that and yes, guys, she also said she grew up around men like uh, ah, and I mentioned them. So that's the reason why. Oh, I saw this comment somewhere and I decided to bring it here. It says, let me tell you a bit about Mervyn, okay? He has auditioned for almost all major American TV shows. He was picked for Big Brother USA and The Circle at the same time, but he decided to go on The Circle instead. He was my favorite player on the show and he was doing great until he tried to date two ladies at a time and he got burnt. His girlfriend on the show kicked him out of for cheating on her. He is a fun guy but he likes women too much <laughs> hey he was also on american america got talent i saw that like guys i have seen him perform on on, on america got talent i'm looking forward to seeing mervin on the show i think he's about to get really popular yes because guys he, he has been on america got talent and trust me this guy here yeah, hey this guy uh, maybe is like someone that is gonna break a lot of hearts like he loves women all these people, we can't be like so all these uh, sets, all these BB Titan housemates. <laughs> now double dating, now they do show. Yeah, JP has how many men in his life, you know? And she even said that all the seven men mm, belongs to her only, like only her. Nobody should try her. Oh, my, hey. Ricky Chidi was like, it wouldn't be such a bad idea if a boo-boo wins this show. Not like he's handsome, muscular, or anything. It would be good for the Abino community to share one of their own to victory. Being on the show alone is a win-win for him, not easy. Like, I would love my Anambra boy to win this show. Who else is supporting a boo-boo? A boo-boo is funny, very intelligent, creative. Like, do you guys hear him, you know, introduce himself last night? when the housemates are introducing themselves like ebubu ebubu is so funny very creative intelligent he says that oh you guys are going to see how creative he is hmm nigerians south africans it can't be like south africans do this one when i don't snap our auntie my auntie yvonne hmm? my favorite anyway she, no matter what i still look, i love her like that okay well guys forget this because i should say a filter and don't use you know design auntie face like this boy as well they say Auntie Jenny looks like Don Jazzy. I hope she's Jenny, right? She's the one, right? Yeah, our 25-year-old Auntie Jenny looks like Don Jazzy. Guys, what do you guys have to say? Like, what do you guys have to say? Well, they look alike. Come like saying that the, that the sister be this. Don Jazzy, your papa, your mama do something. Well, we don't know. Make her come tell us right now. So moving straight to the next one. Okay, um, conversation between Yaya and uh, Yemi. Okay, last time when they were introducing themselves, you know, Yemi said that, oh, okay, Yaya asked um, Yemi a question whether he still has um, another brother that looks like him. Um, Yemi was like, <laughs> oh, that the brother don't marry, but he still has another brother and a sister. Yes, that's what Yemi said, guys. Well, Yemi is a very handsome guy, tall, because almost all the ladies, you know, uh, before they enter the house, they said, oh, I love them, handsome, tall, dark, and all of that. Now, who go go marry all the white white guys where they the house? Voila. Nigerians are not happy with their girls. South Africans are not happy with their guys. Perfect balance. Mm, full stop. Hey, hey. When I say no, only us now can't do intimidate, can't do press. Now, when I not like our guys, we not like our girls. Full stop. Yeah. Question mark. <laughs> Anyways, guys, let's just keep on going. Well, drop your comments in the comment section. What do you have to say about all these things, okay? So, yes, so Nigerians, Yvonne will carry Niger. She's the finest babe. Yvonne removes wig and makeup everywhere. <laughs> Bust. <laughs> yeah, the way they were all removing their makeup last night and their wigs. Ah, 
Well, they're still beautiful. Yeah, I'm gonna know John John that camera with that house is no good, sha. So guys, Yemi um should I say Yemi supported uh Fina last year, as you all can see, says the gap where Fina give Brian past Shams's gap to self. Congratulations, Fina. Who day? You guys saw that, right? Yeah. See, a yeah, diggers association of, of Twitter. On a day dig, walai. Chai. See, your, your secrets no safe for Twitter. <laughs> okay, they say this guy looks like WWE wrestler. Ah. For me, it looks like baby Jesus, shall oh, that's it. <laughs> so, what will a boo-boo fan base be called? A boobians. Call us anything you like. <laughs> well, call us anything you like. We will take her like that, okay? So, yes, Broad thinks this is PTA meeting. Well, maybe in a PTA meeting, they call him. So, it is in a PTA meeting, they call him. You can wear clothes, button and put color. Wonderful. Okay, they don't come again. Swanky was like, anybody who posts Big Brother will either be blocked, muted, or unfollowed, depending on who you are. Be advised, they don't distract me, I beg. Elections is almost here. Sir, I heard you are an, you are an actor, right? Yeah, I heard though. I don't know whether an actor you be. Please, sir, make sure you don't take any scripts at all. Like, make sure you don't act. Make sure you don't take any role at all, okay? Yeah, let's just focus on the election. Coming from Zoba, okay, he or Chiro saying, the organizers of Big Brother and Multi-Choice are too desperate, I beg. They will make this show lose taste very soon. Big Brother Mzanzi and Big Brother Niger happened last year with Big Brother Niger not getting views like the previous ones. Who told you? And in January, when people are supposed to be working on achieving 2023 goals they want us to sit and watch a big brother combo called titans very desperate move to make up for the loss of last year's production if you ask me the big brother don't even resemble shy's play i stopped watching after white money's set this is what zoba zen zeus wrote okay on facebook me hmm. okay let me put my mouth okay Oh, you guys did not see when they said we should go and get our PVC yesterday during the live um launch show. You guys did not see that. No, nobody is even talking about that. Everybody is just coming out to say, oh, it's a distraction. It's not a distraction. Bro, sis, lock your business and sit at home. Let's wait for election. Simple and short. I beg. Big Brother Niger is a senseless program by the senseless and for the most senseless suits of senseless nation. <laughs> Thank God, say you did if. Anybody talking bad about Nigeria, talking bad about everything, calling, you know, the truth senseless, the nature senseless. See, thank God you are even in a senseless country. What is wrong? You that is talking about all these same big brothers, the same big brothers that, you know, millions of people that make money from this show. Everybody should just lock your, their business, sit at home, okay? Yeah, let's sit at home and wait for election. Make hunger fire us, all of us. The person will pick all these BB, um, this Niger <laughs> housemates really wants this great sauce because waiting beyond this. Well, they're not bad. They're not looking bad at all. Yeah, they're not looking bad at all. Or oh, not only fine, fine people go, they go big brother if I should ask, if I may ask. Like, not only fine, fine people then keep for big brother house. Suppose they go big brother house. Shoo, ah. No, multi choice, you need to explain to us what's with these nigerian babes everybody complaining about nigerian babes they're not fine Whew. see you not be only five five people go they go big brother yeah not be only five five people they do not keep a uh, big brother uh, uh, for five five people alone voila even we want to be seeing disabled people not if not for the tax and all of that self disabled people should also be going for big brother anyways guys this is where i'm going to end this particular one drop your comment in the comment section make sure you subscribe like comment and share see you guys in my next one love you Mwah.